All right, all right, all right. Hey YouTube, I'm Lucky, and in today's video, we're gonna give you an update to the recent news story, which was that Bungie messed up the Nightfall loot, the Silicon Neroma was dropping, and it was meant to be Palindrome, and everyone kind of thought it was gonna be Double Drops as well. Uh, I don't know entirely where the Double Drops thing came from, but that was what I was told was going to be next week. It could have just been a rumor, but here we have it. We have Bungie help tweeting out. They have resolved an issue causing the Grandmaster Nightfall catch-up node to be temporarily unavailable. Players should now be able to access the node next to the Grandmaster Nightfall playlist. That happened a few hours ago. Then we had DMG, the community manager, saying, still looking into Palindrome, stay tuned. So I was going to make an update video just in case the Palindrome wasn't able to be fixed because that would have been a huge blunder. Uh, thankfully, Bungie was able to actually fix this. We have an update from uh, Bungie Help here which says we have updated the weekly Nightfall weapon rewards pool for week, the week of May 17th. We've got Palindrome and the plug one, and then we've got removed Silicon Aroma. So there it is, you have the fix there. No double drops. I feel like as an apology uh, to everyone, they should just make it just the Palindrome and double drops, but let me know your thoughts about that in the comments below. That's what I would do if I was Bungie, but I do not work for the Bungo, so I'm unable to do that. In other news, if you haven't seen yet, uh, along with this, actually, let me go over the god rules, so um, before we jump into that, uh, if you haven't seen yet, this real quick, uh, these are the god rules that you should be looking for if you're grinding for it. We got the quick draw rangefinder, that's the roll right there, you can pause the screen. PvP god roll, um, maybe killing wind, and then we've got the PvE god roll. I've already covered this in a few other videos though, and the new one actually has the new origin trait, so it's definitely worth it in both PvP and PvE. Definitely worth grinding for that, so get out there, get to grinding this week. In other news, if you haven't seen the new shader, uh, the new Guardian Games shader photo finish is crazy. Your armor glows. You can go get this in the Eververse store. Look at this ghost. It's glowing. I don't know how well you can see this with this camera setup. I know that this is not my usual setup. I'm on a little vacation right now as I, it's the end of the season and I'm about to go into grind mode with the new season. So look at how crazy that new shader is. Definitely worth grabbing in the Eververse store if you haven't seen that yet. And lastly, this is what it looks like with the Unizersal Voyager sub. That's a wrap on this news video. Let me know your thoughts down below. You're gonna be grinding for that palindrome and uh, I can't wait to cover everything that happens in season 17. So I'm gonna to continue to enjoy my little vacation, go touch some grass. Make sure you're subscribed right here with notifications on. I'll keep you up to date on all the news and everything in Destiny 2. Smash like button. See you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Later.